Before you begin, place the bottle or previously prepared aliquot of complete intestacult organoid growth medium at room temperature. If you do not have any complete medium prepared, remove the basal medium from the refrigerator and place on the bench top to warm to room temperature. Remove the vials of supplement one and supplement two from the freezer and leave to thaw at room temperature. When thawed, add five milliliters of supplement one and five milliliters of supplement two to the bottle of basal medium. Replace the cap and mix the medium well by inverting the bottle several times. The medium must equilibrate to room temperature before use. Intestacult organoid growth medium does not contain any antibiotics. You will need to add your desired antibiotics before using the medium in your experiment. We recommend using gentamicin at 50 micrograms per milliliter. Also thaw Matrigel matrix by placing the vial on ice. You will need 150 microliters of Matrigel for every well to be split. We recommend using growth factor reduced and phenyl red free Matrigel matrix available from Corning Incorporated. Cool DMEM F12 on ice. Place gentle cell dissociation reagent on ice. Place a tissue culture treated 24 well plate in an incubator at 37 degrees Celsius. Using a micropipette and one milliliter pipette tip, completely remove the liquid culture medium from each well that you will passage. Position the pipette tip at the bottom edge of the well so as to avoid disturbing the matrix gel dome. Add one milliliter of gentle cell dissociation reagent on top of the exposed matrix gel dome. Incubate at room temperature for one minute. Pre-wet a one milliliter pipette tip using the gentle cell dissociation reagent. Throughout the procedure, you will need to pre-wet pipette tips and serological pipettes before manipulating organoids or crypt suspensions to prevent the tissues from sticking to the wall of the pipette. Break up the matrix gel dome by pipetting the one milliliter of liquid up and down approximately 20 times. Using the same pipette tip, transfer the suspension to a 15 milliliter conical tube. Rinse the culture well with an additional one milliliter of gentle cell dissociation reagent and add this to the tube. Incubate the 15 milliliter tube on a slowly rocking platform for 10 minutes at room temperature. Centrifuge the tube at four degrees Celsius and 290 RCF for five minutes. After centrifugation, gently pour off the supernatant, leaving the pellet in the tube. Wash the pellet by resuspending it in 10 milliliters of cold DMEM F12 using a pre-wetted 10 milliliter serological pipette. Centrifuge at four degrees Celsius and 200 RCF for five minutes. Gently pipette off and discard the supernatant. The pelleted crypts are now ready for culture in a one-to-one -one mixture of culture medium and matrix gel. From this point in the procedure forward, the technique for culturing the pelleted sample is identical to that used to culture freshly isolated intestinal crypts. Add 150 microliters of room temperature intestacult organoid growth medium to the pellets in each tube. Retrieve the pre-warmed 24 well plate from the incubator and place it on the bench top in readiness for plating the matrix gel mixture you will make in the next step. Add 150 microliters of undiluted matrix gel to the crypts and culture medium in each tube. Pipette up and down 10 times using the same pipette tip to thoroughly resuspend the pellet. Avoid introducing bubbles. Slowly pipette 50 microliters of each concentrated crypt suspension into the center of each of four wells of the pre-warmed 24 well plate. The samples should form domes in the middle of each well. Being careful not to disturb the matrix gel domes, place the plate in an incubator at 37 degrees Celsius. Incubate for 10 minutes to set the matrix gel. Add 750 microliters of room temperature intestacult organoid growth medium to each well by pipetting the medium gently down the sidewall of the well be careful not to pipette the medium directly onto the domed cultures. Add sterile PBS to any unused wells to reduce evaporation of medium from the plate during culture. 
Place the lid on the culture plate and incubate at 37 degrees Celsius and 5% carbon dioxide. Organoids begin to bud after two to four days in culture. The culture medium should be fully exchanged three times per week. Aspirate the existing liquid medium, keeping the pipette tip at the edge of the well bottom. Replace with 750 microliters of fresh, room temperature intesticult organoid growth medium. After seven to 10 days, the organoid cultures are fully mature and ready for passaging. Organoids will expand and exhibit crypt budding over the five to seven days following plating. Organoids should be passaged between days seven and 10 post plating to prevent overgrowth and excessive accumulation of debris within the lumen. For a detailed protocol for initiating intestinal organoid cultures using crypts isolated from mouse small intestine, watch the video Mouse Intestinal Organoid Culture with Intesticult Organoid Growth Medium. Intesticult Organoid Growth Medium, the next dimension in intestinal research.